so we understand what is md01 how to take mrp run what is mdbt now always remember in mdbt uh, we are going to have mrp run is going to be taken on monthly basis or weekly basis it is happened only in the background it happens in the lean period lean period means what whenever there is no customer like in the night time where there is a less load on system very few people are working on your laptop the main people who are working uh, with the sap system they are doing their job in a general shift rest of the people who are going to work uh, there are very few people that who is doing inverting of material invoice verification at material gate those only two three people will be available but rest of the staff who is using mrp or using sap they will be having their day off okay or that is saturday or sunday morning or sunday night something like that or first day of the month or early in the morning so very few people will be available in that kind of lean period it is taken so that there should not be any uh, hindrance there should not be any server load and system should run very smoothly so that is a cause we have to take mrp run with the p code mdbt and that is in a lean period clear now next t code is md02 okay single item multi level so again and again we have seen this t code uh, running here slash an md02 okay we can take mrp run of single item and multi level what is mean by single item multi level so if you go to this slide again here you understand single item finished good this is my finished good this is single item multi level means at this level and this level also first mrp will be run at your header material okay this is your header material finished product at this level mrp run happened the next system will go further and mrp run will happen on second part second component what is second component means you are suppose now we are having this b so let me make it b140 okay and okay. so plant 1000 okay so whatever is your bomb okay slash o cs03 okay for laptop b14 what is my bomb 1000 okay bomb is one enter here are these are my what do you say below portal okay so first of all bomb will uh, mrp run happen or again i have taken the water just in the this is my material. Okay, enter, enter. Ah, now I'll turn bomb one. So bomb MRP run will happen on this. Then it will go to the next part. Then it will go to the next part. Then next and next and next so on. So you are, remember right? We talk how bomb explosion happens. So in this single item multi level, MRP run will happen on this all component of bomb. Okay. First on this header material. Then on semi finish. And then when semi finish completed, it will go for if the semi finish on some raw material, it will go for those raw material and it will stop. That is called single item multi level MRP run. Okay. Okay. MD02, that is single item multi level. Okay. Planning of bomb structure, all this component, possibility of changing the master plan for each material and bomb manually. The system plans the single material at a plant provide on the selection screen this type of planning run plans the higher level material for which planning run is carried out and also the bomb level below the material suggesting the multi level explosion okay clear team okay are we clear yes sir everyone single item multi level is clear now single yes, item single level planning single item single level planning is what md0 3t code okay now i will keep this open slash omd03 okay almost same okay but here we don't have this option process control parameter and all because those are not going to be useful okay so here we are going to have single item single layer so we are going to take mrp run for laptop b14 it will run only for laptop b14 it will no more go further okay after this it will not go for the next level okay so single item single level planning planning of planning one bomb level only so first level only it will not go for semi finished okay dependent requirement are transmitted for the next bomb level manual changes can be made at any point of time okay so only dependent requirement go past but next component mrp run will not happen 
okay so whatever we talk about here sorry in this slide earlier six step mrp run in this it will go up to this okay bomb explosion will not happen okay are you getting my point md03 single atom single level planning okay the system only plans the single material that is header component provided on the selection screen and one below this material suggests a single level explosion this method does not explode the bomb for the subsequent lane dependent requirement are transmitted manual changes can be made at the time so md03 is very rarely used okay but these are the different t codes by which we can take mrp run but most favorite is md02 because it is going to take mrp run suppose you take a, you have completed your mrp run okay and after that you understand there are some errors then you can go again and take mrp run with the md0 t t code okay so this is the use of md0 t t code okay uh, are we clear sir yeah. what uh, sir what do you mean by the manual changes the okay. manual changes means manual changes can be made at any time you told right in single level planning yes yes so how come that is different from multi level planning and in multi level okay. planning uh, demand is going to flow from header material to this uh, other second component and from here it will go to the last okay that is clear here the planning will happen at this header level but it will not go for the next mrp run that is second point okay yeah, yeah that that is clear sir but uh, uh, manual changes means like uh, we can't do that manual changes in multi level or uh, no in multi level mrp we cannot do any changes okay mrp run has to happen okay so it is md02 okay we can run mrp run like mrp run happens okay slash n md03 same material okay So here we are having option display result prior setting. Okay. Okay. We can go over here. We can firm date. Now, if you want to change some dates, okay. Firm dates. Okay. Manual firming. So you can go and change the dates. Okay. We want to okay while it. running itself, we will have an option to adjust the so dates. We can make some changes. After 18, you have to make some changes. You have to manually form. So these are the so you have to change the procurement. Uh, so we don't have any procurement proposal. We have production order. So we can create manual order over here. Okay. Suppose we have to create triple inter. Order type you have to select. Okay. TP01. Let me type it manually. So I speak here. I present there. And I'm creating one order for 100,000 quantity manually. Okay, in that, we have to give the date. Again, date should be 31st. Okay, in that, 700,000. Now, you can see this production order, production order for 1000 quantity, I'm going to save. That was error. Fast of it, fast is not. Now, if you go over here, now if you go for laptop B14, slash N MD04, you can see manual firming is done with MD03. Okay, and here you can oh, see yeah. production order is created. Okay, and it is released for 1000 quantity. So, manual changes we can do with this MD03. But, guys, it is not expected you should play with your MRP. You never suggest anything to your customer because it is going to make all things uh, go on task because of your intervention manually. Okay, can you see it is showing the advantage to confirm. They are changing something after this date. Okay, you are created manual production order, which is not expected. System should always go with the own calculation and everything. Clear? Yes, sir. This is yeah. the difference between MD02 and MD03. 
ओके